Splatoon and Super Mario Maker are big sellers for Nintendo, but not everything looks great for the Japanese company. Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens is announced and more. My name is Your Raptor and this is the Raptor News of February 2nd, 2016. While the Wii U struggles, the games on Nintendo system perform really well. In a new financial report, the Japanese game maker announced that Splatoon has now sold more than 4 million units, with Mario Maker sitting at 3.34 million units. Over on the 3DS side, Animal Crossing Happy Own Designer is the best selling game of the financial year, 2.93 million units sold. I thought the game was kinda boring by the way, no challenge at all, but anyway, the software sales are even more impressive if you look at the total numbers of Wii U sold. The console now sold more than 12 million units, which means that 1 out of 3 owners of the Wii U bought Splatoon. Great that it sold so well, and I think we will really see more now. Also the Amiibo will not go anywhere, because they are now at 20 million units sold, unbelievable. Let me know what you think of the Nintendo sales figures in the comments or via social media. In the March cover of the big gaming magazine Game Informer, LEGO Star Wars The Force Awakens was revealed. The game was already leaked before the announcement, but now we know for sure that we can play the Episode 7 story with LEGO figurines. The game will have its own take on the story and it will also feature content that bridges the gap between the return of the Jedi and The Force Awakens. I don't really like Star Wars or LEGO, so I will not play this, but there must be a ton of people that want to play The Force Awakens story and not want to do it in Disney Infinity. Are you excited? Let me know in the comments or via social media. Vote to play is back on February 9th. PlayStation gamers can vote on one of the three PlayStation Plus games. The winner of the poll will be free in next month's PlayStation Plus update. So that's awesome for us and also for the dev because they get money for that. You can vote for a twin stick shooter called Android Cactus. The over the top action figures come to live game Action Hank. Um, that's from uh, the Netherlands, that's pretty cool, that's where I live. And also the side-scrolling shooter with a lot of muscles, Broforce. That's of course already available on PC. My first quote goes to that one because it seems like a lot of fun and while Android Cactus also looks interesting, I know that Broforce is a good game and I'm not so sure if Android Cactus will be. You can vote on February 9th for your favorite PlayStation Plus game. Let me know which one you will choose in the comments or via social media. Thanks for listening to the Raptor News of February 2nd. Remember, Raptor News is on SoundCloud and YouTube every weekday on 8 p.m. Central European Time and 11 a.m. Pacific Time and a day later on iTunes. Report your news to me via Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, all your Raptor or via Raptor News at yourraptor.com. Like the Raptor News if you did, subscribe to the Your Raptor YouTube channel and I will speak to you tomorrow. Goodbye.